Yeah, probably the biggest example of one of those was the we sued Sandridge and it was a corporate uh, securities derivative case. That was a case where we maintained that the company was not being run correctly. We maintained that some of the uh, people on the leadership team, for example, the board, were running that company basically to profit themselves as opposed to the stockholders. So that case ended up uh, settling. It was a very successful resolution of the case. So what we're seeing today is that business owners often find themselves where they have no choice but to hire a lawyer because they're being cheated not by individuals, they're being cheated by other business owners. And so when they find themselves in that unenviable position, they really don't have a choice. They either have to, you know, put up with being cheated or hire a lawyer and try to stop it. And so we've done quite a few of those types of things. And you're seeing, I think, in this world uh, that happen quite often, actually.